the man killed in a bizarre chain reaction crash in North Portland. Jason Barnes died Thursday after police say a drunk driver hit a parked car, then drove up on the sidewalk and hit him. Our Jennifer Dowling talked to this man's friend. She joins us now live. Jennifer, this is such a sad story. What was Barnes doing that night? Well, it is, Trevor. And friends say this was a case of Jason just being in the wrong place at the wrong time. They say he was collecting cans at the time that he was killed. And his good friend from middle school, Teresa Witt, says the 32 year old had fallen on some hard times and collected those cans on Thursday nights in the North Portland neighborhood where he was killed. Barnes was on the sidewalk at the time of the crash off North Willamette near a group of recycling bins when police say Kalen Breitenberg rounded the corner at a high speed. Then hit a blue sedan. While Breitenberg's car continued into the street, then appeared to swerve, driving over the curb and running over some trees before hitting Barnes. Witt says Barnes was living in a tent not far from where he was killed. She said he had a good heart and will be missed. We went, we went to school out in Beaverton, and he was, he was a good, good kid. Um, when I first met him, Jason was going to school. It's like he had his own car, had his own apartment. He was doing great, and it's like. One thing led to another. He was down on his luck, but he had, he had the biggest heart, nicest guy, and it's like nobody deserves to die like this. Tim Hurt says he has friends who know the driver of the car as well. He says he feels bad for him too, as his life is about to change drastically due to potential consequences of this crash. Now, police say that Breitenberg is facing several charges, including DUI and second degree manslaughter. Back to you, Trevor. All right.